guess what guys I'm doing another hair review yay and it's on another Aliexpress vendor so I know you guys love these videos because we all like to go and and buy you know affordable but good hair the owner of the company did contact me to do this hair um let me tell you guys when i talked to the company owner or the owner of the company she was like hey you know i would love for you to try our uh curly hair and i was like mm. I don't know. I'm thinking it to myself. I'm like, oh, I don't know because I have not worn curly hair in like forever. And I was like, well, and I thought about it. I was like, well, the only way I would really do curly hair is if I can do a closure with it because um, my hair is just not the same texture. Um, I asked her, I was like, hey, you know, is there any way I can do closure too? And she was like, yeah, sure. I'm really liking this. The company is called AS Hair Company. Again, it is on AliExpress. I will put the link below. So this right here is Malaysian curly hair. Now, um, it's funny how they make up these names in Malay. Like, you know, to tell you the truth, I've never seen a Malaysian person have this much of a curly hair. But you know, they. I don't know. I guess they have to make up some name. I don't know. This is really, really tight curl. When it first came in, it was really, uh, really, really curly. And I was like, oh no, I hope I don't look like Diana Ross here. And I had Instagrammed this picture. Um, someone did tell me, like, once you co wash it, it should, the curls should, you know, get uh, a little looser. And I was like, ah, I hope so. But you know what? Um, the curls didn't get that much looser but I don't feel like it's really really big like do you guys think this is big because I, I, don't, I don't really think so at all I got this hair in a 22-20-18 and a 14 inch closure the closure let me zoom in here the closure had these baby hairs let me tell you something about curly closures um, for some reason they always put straight hair or straight baby hairs in cur curly closures and it's like it's so weird that they do that because it's like these long straight hairs and everything else is curly so it's really weird so I end up cutting um, my baby hairs in half so I could just go ahead and like um, you know gel them down or whatever so that wasn't much of a problem but I don't know why they do that this hair is extremely soft I haven't had any tangles in it. This hair is like a plant. <laughs> I heard Renee say that. <laughs> um, it is. It, it. You need water, okay? Um, so yeah, basically what I did was I sprayed it down with my water bottle. Um, and then I used this curl definer. And this is from Paul Mitchell. This is called Twisted, Twist Around. And I love the packaging in this thing. This is really, really nice. So I just used a little bit of this while it was damp. And I started on the ends and I kind of massaged it all the way up to keep the curls nice and defined. I thought that it was, when I first wore the hair, I wore it just like it was. And I kind of finger curled, combed it out and it did get big. So if you guys like big hair, you can most definitely wear it, you know, really, really big. But since I put that curl definer in, um, it's it's kind of like stayed the way it was, just like how it is now. And it's been like this for, I want to say like 12 hours. Um, so yeah, it's kind of been like tamed down and, and more manageable. I haven't had any shedding at all, like none, no shedding. And um, I, which is really good and surprisingly because um, usually when I get curly weaves, like they shed the most. I mean, they shed worse than straight hair, wavy hair put together. Like curly hair, I don't know why, it just sheds horribly. Like that's always been my experience. But um, I, I haven't had that with this. So um, I'm gonna show you guys the ends. So these are the ends. I don't know if you guys can see. Um, yeah, these are the ends. They're a little bit thin at the end, but I don't think it's that big of a deal. You can most certainly snip that little bit off if you want. But I don't see that um, being a really big deal doing that. Um, 
Um, there was a little bit of a smell to the hair. Um, nothing that was unbearable, but it was a little like, hmm, you know, it, it does kind of smell like processed or whatever. I, um, when I did co-wash the hair, I did not get any dye or anything out like that. So I did kind of slick down my baby hair there. Um, yeah, I slicked it down here and I use um, Matrix Curl, what the heck is this? Curl Boulez Super Defrizzer Gel. <laughs> so I just took like a little, little bit of this and then I kind of placed it on there and I used, I think it was just a regular brush and I kind of swept it to the little side here. So, yeah. Um, I also just face framed the front. Now, guys, um, some of you who are not um, licensed cosmetologists, it's okay because, you know, not all of us can afford us cosmetologists. It's fine. I understand. Let me tell you, with curly hair, some people who don't want it really, really big and you want layers, do not cut a lot of layers. I'm telling you right now because you are going to poof up like a big ball. Um, yes, you are. <laughs> no razor. Don't, don't use no razor. Please, don't. Gosh, no. It's going to be a disaster. I'm telling you. No, it, it'll be bad and then you'll be crying so no razor use a use some shears um, I'm sure you can get some from like the beauty supply store or like salaries or whatever um, yes use um, some shears and I would suggest you if you're gonna wear this and you have your different layers you're going to really you're just gonna walk into my freaking video how y'all doing ladies and gentlemen call me uh, fresh cut hubby because Oh, we have a fresh cup for the wife. Buy some drink. I don't want the taste. It. No, Please. no. Come on, I can only drink water. Right. Yeah, I have tea there. Say bye bye. Isn't she lovely? Don't try to suck up. Isn't she wonderful? Mm. Don't step on my lighting. So yeah, I would since you're you're going to have your different lengths of hair, um, you know, like I got 20, 20, 22, 20, and 18, and then the, the four, 14 inch closure. Um, leave that. Leave. Let it be your layers. Okay. Don't touch none of this. If you want to um, face frame, I'm a big fan of face framing. Uh, you guys hear me talk about this all the time. Um, if you want to face frame, then yeah. I don't. I wouldn't see a problem with that without it, you, all of your hair get really puffy and just big and gross. Again, don't use a razor. Just use you know some shears and you know just go ahead and cut it down at, at an angle or whatever you want to do. Um, yeah, I would just suggest doing that. A little bit about the closure. The closure. I don't know the dimensions of the closure. Okay, I never got the dimensions of it, but it is wide. Like some closures are more kind of like right in here and then they're long in the back so they stop like back there. Um, this one is wide and it's shorter, which I don't have a problem with. I'd rather it be wider so I can have more of a natural hairline in the front than it being, you know, just long back here. Like I don't need that. I can weave that back there. The knots are not bleached at all I did not bleach them but um, I might do a video on um, how I get bleach knots without actually bleaching them if you guys are afraid to use bleach so yeah I might go ahead and do that video with this if you would like to see me do that then let me know and I will do that for you but yeah I guess that's it I hope you guys like this hair because I'm kind of feeling it especially for the uh, summertime I'm really feeling the curly hair you know I kind of feel like I belong in Brooklyn even though I'm a Baltimore girl whatever I yeah I, I know I, I like it I, I like the curly hair Gabriel likes it too so I mean whatever it only ultimately goes to what I like so 
I do, I like this. So yeah, if you guys have any questions about the hair, um, just let me know. You guys know how to get in touch with me. And yeah, I will see you guys in another video. Bye.